Hey everybody, uh, King Nick is back. Uh, we're gonna do another Isaac run. Uh, we're gonna play as Azazel this time. As you'll, as you'll notice, we'll, we're making our way pretty far into the character roster. So let's get going with Azazel, who is easily the easiest character to play as. He starts off with uh, flying, uh, three black hearts, and a short range brimstone laser. Uh, the brimstone laser hits everything. It does a lot of damage. Uh, not that much damage to kill that thing though. And flying is insanely useful. We won't have to pass up any drops because of rocks. Maybe because of no bombs, but not because of rocks. Oh, we got some bombs there. Too bad they're alive. Oh, we did not take damage there. I'm calling that a win. The most I can say about Azazel is I, unless something goes terribly wrong, we're gonna beat Mom's heart. Um, Azazel is able to pick up. Um, See, that's how useful flying is. Azazel is able to pick up uh, range upgrades, but I feel like they have a, uh, a lessened effect on him. To be fair, I don't know how much a uh, range upgrade increases everybody else's range, but... This will be... Alright, this might make us lose the run. <laughs> Anti-grav and brimstone laser. Normally, if you have a brimstone laser and you fire it, you'll, um, er, alright, normally if you have anti-grav tears and you shoot, uh, your tears will sit in place, uh, before flying towards the target. Once you let go of the, uh, the shot, uh, button, the, the tears will begin to fly. Uh, Brimstone does something different. Uh, I honestly have never tried it with uh, Azazel, so I don't know how his uh, Brimstone laser will be affected. But we'll find out as soon as this match starts. Oh, yep, that's what normal Brimstone does. So uh, now enemies will take damage as they walk through the uh, through the puddle of brimstone, and they'll also take damage when it fires off, which it will fire off in the direction we're facing when we let go of the button. We got growth hormone, so that's a damage upgrade that we'll need. Um, all right, you also notice that uh, Azazel here starts with a full card, which is. Um, not incredibly useful all the time, but it has its uses. Um, I might show it off here, it depends on how the run goes. I don't like this combination of items. Um, it's not going to be a death sentence, but I just don't really like the combination. If you're fighting enemies that chase you, it's a little better. Um, but if you're fighting enemies that just hop around randomly, you're you're gonna be doing this for a while. Because the enemies that chase you, they will go into the puddle. Uh, the enemies that are move randomly, uh, when will they do that? You know. There, oh yeah, I got it. Okay. Spiders are always terrible. I never like spiders. Oh yeah, if you remember last time we unlocked everything is terrible. In which the game actually gets harder. So this will be our first game after doing that. And through no fault of the game I take damage. I'm going to go into the boss room. I will fight Dingle. You going to move? Nope. Alright. Sit there and take that. I will fight Dingle, get the health upgrade. Um, Azazel can pick up health upgrades, um, but doesn't start out with any red hearts. 
that actually uh, makes him more likely to get a deal with the devil on the uh, second floor because since you start out with three black cards, you're less likely to ha take red heart damage. Alright, let's just search the floor for the item room. I, I really wish I didn't pick up anti-grav. Um, I don't like the tier pattern. It does let me get away from the shots. So I'm a little uh, I'm a little protected from uh, enemies that explode. But I'm overall not happy with the uh, with the combination. Anti-grav tears is is a nice item. Don't let me tell you it's not. It's just I wish I didn't have it with brimstone. Harlequin Baby will give us some shots while we charge up our laser. Oh, and this is the best. We, uh, I'm not even worried about the rest of the floor now. Or the rest of the run now. Watch this. Huh. We just destroyed that one room with an, uh, with an item that will recharge every single room. So it's not even a rare thing that we do. Uh, we picked up Tammy's head. Tammy's head, every room, uh, will fire off a burst of shots in eight directions of your tears. Um, because we're Azazel, uh, it's a brimstone laser. Were we any other character, it would just be eight normal tears. Um, so I, I will never pass up Tammy's head as Azazel. That's why. <laughs> it's very obvious why. Nope. Oh, sometimes it does, doesn't work out though. But it's still fine. Um, again, I would prefer if we didn't have the the tears, the anti-grav. But we're gonna win. I feel I feel confident enough that we'll win. Um, Parasite's gonna be useless. It's not gonna do anything for us. I'm gonna pick it up because I don't want to feel like I wasted the key. That's the end of that story. Oh, the item that I passed up in the devil room um, is the shovel. What it does is, um, I think uh, once every six rooms, I'm not certain about the room number, but I'm pretty sure it's six. Um, It'll let us open a uh, portal to the next floor. Alright, thank you for not dodging. That's all I wanted. I hate those things. They never pop their head up when you want them to. Alright, we actually have a library and a shop again. Um, Unfortunately, this time I have no keys, so I am unable to try either of them. We got the goat hoof. It's a speed upgrade. A trinket. I'm gonna try this out for a floor. No, it doesn't do it. Okay. keep the full with us. We're taking a lot of health damage actually. Um, okay, so I have, ni I have 19 cents. I have a key. Um, I'm just going to go in here. I'm going to try this room. I'm going to hope it's a shop because I don't want a book. Good. It's going to be a PhD and that will drop a tears upgrade. Tears upgrades are good. It means uh, we'll have a shorter time to charge our shots. Alright, who do we have for the boss? We have Mega Maw. 
and it's dead. Need some money. About the same as last time. And now we actually have a deal with the angel. Uh, because we didn't take the deal with the devil, we gave ourselves a, uh, a chance to get the deal with the angel on the next floor. Um, if we take an item in here, which there isn't one, um, um, if we take an item in here, we have a precedent for the angel rooms. Let's see if this works. I think, uh, no, it doesn't work right now. That's a secret for later. I keep missing my buttons up. All right, we're just gonna head on down. There's nothing here I want now. The other room's gonna be a library, um, and there's only a couple other rooms I can explore, and we would sacrifice our uh, boss rush for it, so it's not really worth it. I think what I really want right now is the nine volt. That would make this uh, Tammy's head recharge faster over the course of one room. Dude, this killed one of them. All right. Missed the other one. Got a key for the item room. I wonder how this works. Let's do it. <laughs> All right. Um, these, none of these do any damage. <laughs> they, they'll do some damage, but they, it won't matter. It won't be, it won't have a real effect on us. Actually, I should test it out before I say that. No, it's still doing alright damage, alright. Maybe I found a good item combination. If you'll remember, I'm blowing up, um, slot machines for an undisclosed achievement all right I uh, I feel a bit better about anti-grav for the sole fact uh, we gotta fight carrying Queen there now I'm going to explore um, I really just want to have a chance to get spirit hearts before we go down Let's try a bomb here. I don't know what's in that other room. Whatever it is, it gives me a deal, uh, secret room. Speed up. Speed up. Let's move faster than I can control. Alright, we're going to get Guppy's Paw. Guppy's Paw will actually give us spirit hearts in a way. Alright, I'm going to pick it up. I'm going to use it once. Guppy's Paw turns one red heart into three spirit hearts so use it sparingly the red hearts don't come back Harlequin baby is actually doing some damage All right, and I'm gonna lose all the spirit hearts before the floor ends, probably. Making me go back in there and use it, uh, use Guppy's paw again. <sighs> this is so far a confusing run. It is not bad, but I don't know how to feel about it. Um, I'm gonna go back in here and uh, again do the slot machine thing. Just get, get a um, an eternal heart. Um, if I haven't explained eternal hearts, if you carry one all the way down to the uh, next floor, it becomes a full red heart. You saw it earlier. I uh, picked up two in a row, so they became to they together became a uh, full red heart. Um, if you take any red heart damage when you have an eternal heart, you're going to lose the eternal heart. That, so if you have three spirit hearts, an eternal heart, or a red heart and an eternal heart, 
if you go to the blood bank, you'll lose your eternal heart. So uh, be really mindful of, of that. You don't want to lose it. it. Well, you might. You could actually want to lose it. It's a health upgrade. You just have to wait a full floor to, for it to become effective. Alright. These things are a nightmare for me. Hopefully I don't take more damage. I don't really want to give up the deal. We have deal with the angel. I can show off more things that I haven't shown off before. And this is where 9 volt would come in handy. I'm sitting here being nervous trying to avoid all the champions. He died. I didn't know that happened. Apparently enemies die when they drop off the, the map. We got a box of stuff. That will give us a key. A speed upgrade, which I'm going to take because I can't tell you why not. A wheel of fortune, which I'm going to use specifically to bomb. And we got to deal with the angel room, which is uh, on the curse of the blind. So we got, sa oh, we got sacred heart. Homing shot. It gives us homing shots and it gives us a damage upgrade. Um, I wish we got this on any other character. I love Azazel, but it's wasted on him. Um, we're, so we already have. We don't like. We don't benefit from um, from homing shots, and it's it's harder to show it off. I like. Uh, I'll take Liberty Cap. Liberty Cap will give us a, uh, a random uh, mushroom effect every room. But it's harder to show it off when... Um... Alright, got left hand. And um, the left hand will make more chest drops red chest instead of uh, golden chest like Guppy's Tail would. Shoot. Um, yeah, so I, I would prefer to get get it on any other character for the sole fact that peeper. <laughs> Let me finish the sentence. <laughs> we'll see. Uh, I can't show it off fully on this guy. I want to show it off as much as I can. And Sacred Heart is a really rare item. You're not going to see it for another couple of... I don't know if I if it ever shows up in another let's play um, it'll be it'll be pretty rare so appreciate it when you have it and uh, uh, carp appreciate it when you have it and I just wish I could have showed it better donate some money there I'm not leaving here without Tammy's head Doo -doo -doo. The remote detonator, uh, when you pick it up, it gives us five bombs, and when you lay down a bomb, uh, you have to press your item button, so uh, for me it's going to be uh, the left trigger, and that'll activate it. Uh, it'll set your bomb off. bomb is on the off chance it works or it matters oh, and we got a dime yeah dimes are the most money you can get in one coin unless you have counterfeit penny <laughs> nah that's not true there's a quarter but it's a uh, an item room item it's not a consumable drop there's also a dollar bill uh, which I haven't seen since I started playing this uh, run through pick up that. Alright, Peeper's Eye here is going to um, fly around the room and it'll hit enemies. When it does, it'll do damage to them. Everybody's in the center of the room enough. Let's fire off a bunch of these things. 
Uh, we have a chance to make it to the deal with the devil. Or to the, uh... To the uh, boss rush room. But for it, for it to happen, we have to go fast. So let's see if we can... Alright. Let's do that. We're going to fight Mom now because we have the full... Jesus Juice will give us a damage upgrade. That'll give us the ability to fly in Spectral Tears, so you can see why it's a waste of time. We don't need Spectral Tears. We already shoot through rocks. Um, I'm going to go with Dark Bum, because Dark Bum will pick up items. Or he'll pick up Red Hearts and drop Spirit Hearts. So for the times when we're full on uh, Spirit Heart, or Red Hearts, he will give us more Spirit. I'm saving Tammy's head for um, this little bugger. So I don't want it to poop red blood. Or red poop. It seems to me that most of our damage is going to be dealt um, from the pulls. All right, so now we have uh, Duke of Flies and Peep. And if it looks bad, I'm gonna bail. I'm not gonna finish the, uh, the boss rush. And it's starting to look bad. Again, I would be so much happier in this run if I didn't have anti-grav tears. Um, But that's not, you know, that's not a thing right now. Let's not worry about it. Sit here, hanging back behind the rocks. They can't hit me, and I can just keep unleashing a torrent of uh, brimstone lasers. All right. Um, well, if I, all right, I'm gonna be uh, careful here. I'm gonna try not to take another hit. Normally they drop hearts. Um, spirit hearts or red hearts. Alright, Loki, you have to stop. I need you to come on. It's cool you want to fight, but I gotta finish this. Alright, we are at a half heart. Um... Nobody's going to drop any health. Really? Come on, guys. Uh, and I wasted it. Alright, uh, so I got cocky. We started uh, the runoff with me being cocky. Um, and you see what happened for it. Um, I I'm, I want to blame Antigraph Tears, but I, that was my fault. I'm sorry, everybody. Uh, thank you for watching. I hope you like it. Uh, I hope you subscribe. Um, I hope you have a good day.